All right, Steve French here, the voice of the Zips, getting ready for Akron's opener against the Nebraska Cornhuskers in two weeks. The final full field uh, scrimmage it was today. Coach Terry Bowden, uh, give us your overall assessment of how things went. You know, I mean, the, the, the offense lost all three centers. We had no centers today. We had two of them that didn't practice. The first one knocked out early. We had to move Carl Ritz. He hadn't even had a snap. And then we couldn't hardly get a snap going. So it really hurts your effectiveness on offense because you're getting a bad snap out of every other snap. I told our players that when that's happening, defense play great, offense don't turn the ball over, fight for a first down or two, make one play, let the defense hang you on. Uh, but, I, but I think it's one of those days when you, when you don't have a center going that you got to watch individual blocks, individual runs, and those things. But uh, we just got to hope our guy that got banged up there didn't get hurt bad and we're, we'll have him back out on the field. Well, obviously, in any uh, scrimmage situation, injuries are always a concern. But at the same time, you gotta you gotta go live and have contact before that first game. Oh no, we have, you do what you have to do. Uh, but uh, yeah, but again, defensively, I saw some great pass rush today. I thought uh, Sampson did a. I mean, uh, he stuck out today. I, I saw a ton of big plays by him. He has that ability if he'll keep that motor running like that. Uh, him and Jamal Davis gave us a real push off the edge in our pass protection. I got after it pretty good. So overall, though, I think I think uh, the defense I think played really well. The offense did a pretty good job of hanging on in a very very difficult situation. Uh, we're talking with Terry Bowden, of course. He did have some uh, some good runs in there. So as the quarterback competition continues uh, with uh, Cato Nelson number one, but it's hard to evaluate on a day like today. Yeah, I think I mean Cato's number one. If Cato just continues to do what he needs to do, I think uh, Alex Remard can can play better, can play better every day and get closer. But right now, we need to Cato to play like he did today. Quarterbacks ran the ball pretty well, uh, and again, that's part of that part of what we do when they get that ball. They need to make plays. So we scored every time almost in the red zone, but I don't think we got over the 50 when we were backed up. You know, um, uh, of course, they were expecting rain today. It did not rain this morning, which happens every time we're expecting rain. So you're indoors and it's humid, but in a lot of ways, that's that's more like what you're going to see in a couple of weeks. Well, you know, you know, we practice in the morning, and we have found the summer if we've got to get ready for hot weather. We come in, players don't like to come in here because this is hot. It's humid and it's hot and it prepares you to play in hot weather. This is probably the hottest day they've had in the entire preseason. So, and you could see it wear on them because how hot it is. Again, we're talking with Terry Bowden, and the one thing being inside, uh, obviously no kicking or anything like that today. Yeah, we do kicking every day. We'll, we, we had a lot of things lined up to go live and kicking. We're going to move that probably to our next practice on Monday, get that in. We do kick every day. That's very important that you have that kicking game sewed up that first game. Make sure your coverage and your protection is very sound. And then finally, uh, the week ahead, of course, InfoCision is busy on Friday with a concert. This is your last uh, full uh, scrimmage, but how deep or when do you start your your preparation specifically for Nebraska? Well, we've had a long, tough uh, uh, preseason. We'll actually start doing some things cutting back on Monday. Now, uh, by Wednesday, you're into your full week and a half game mode for the first game of the season. But we'll start establishing some scout teams now and trying to get guys relaxed a little more. They're, they're having to play with leg tired, uh, play weary, and that's we got to get, get them back starting this week. All right, very good. We'll see you next week. Thanks. All right, of course, that is Terry Bowden, and this is Steve French for the Zips Digital Network.